Hello and welcome to the latest episode of Gin with Spearing. Get innovating now with Retico. Today's topic is the Micro 800 range of PLCs from Rockwell Automation. I'd like to welcome back Richard Parker. Richard is one of our product sales specialists to be with us today. Richard, the ability to move from that smart relay to a PLC application can be a real challenge for customers. The Micro 800 range offers that next stage for customers that want to look at more functionality and also in the reverse when their current PLC is slightly overkill. Can you give the three main reasons for using the Micro 800 PLCs? Yes, thanks Darren. First of all, it's got a compact small footprint with modular scalability using plug modules. So you've got things like Hardy Wayne scale, BACnet, HVAC, analog memory timers and lots more. Brilliant. Also, there's free CCW software used to program the unit. You've got ladder, function block, structured text programming, and obviously we offer HMI as well. You've got integration with other Rockwell products through internet, so things like drives, HMIs, E300 overloads, things like that. Fantastic, okay, so a lot of integration there, okay, within that, that platform. Thanks Richard for that, okay, let's look at the product in a bit more detail. We're gonna move from Richard over to Janaxon. I'm looking at you now. Right. So this is the Micro 820, which Richard mentioned earlier. It's got quite a small footprint, almost fits in my hand. Uh, we've got the onboard I.O. Uh, terminal box at the top and the bottom, and then the plug-in modules just on the front. So these blanks snap off like this, and the plug-in modules just on the front like that. So here we've got a serial module and a analog module, and that's just extended your I.O. without having to go and take additional space on the DIN rail. We've got a Ethernet port here, and it's programmed using Connected Components Workbench, which is a free download. The Ethernet port also allows you to communicate with uh, HMI drives or other products, something that may communicate on Modbus TCP. And on top, you can also use RS-232 or 485, which allows you to do Modbus RTU as well. And finally, on the right hand side, we've got an SD card for backups, data logging and recipes. So that's the Micro 820. It's question time again. Richard mentioned three methods of programming the Micro 800 series. So put your answers for those three methods at the bottom via email back to us and there's another £20 pizza voucher okay available so good luck with that support is always available from Retico Richard and Janaxon who's had to go away for a bit of a lie down if you want to discuss your application in a bit more detail get innovating now with Retico and please use the below links subscribe to the Retico YouTube channel today to see more practical product videos look out for the next gym whispering video again I'd like to thank Richard and hopefully Janaxon okay will wake up at some time later today thank you in preparation for the Rugby World Cup, should we try that Japanese gin? Good luck to all the countries that are participating. Matinee.